Hello everyone. This is your daily romance tarot for April the 15th, 2017. I am Melinda Nail Fanatic of Nail Fanatics Artistry Design Studio and Love, Peace and Happiness Tarot in Las Vegas, Nevada. We are going to begin this reading with a word of clarity from my own cup, uh, custom words of clarity deck. And if you're interested in one of these for yourself, I'll tell you more about it at the end. What is the word, love, source, God, that wants to be heard by my brothers and sisters of humanity's beloved beings for today, April the 15th, 2017, into their romance life, love, source, God. What is it about romance that needs to be heard and seen today? Oh, okay. This one. Familial. Okay, so family is important. And it seems that family has something very key to do with your romantic situation at this time. And we're going to also use these decks. I forgot to put them out before I started recording, but I'll set them out now. So you know what I'm using because a lot of you really want to know. So let's see what is the message from the Wisdom of the Golden Path in regards to Romance for us for today, April the 15th, 2017, in regards to romance. Thank you, thank you, thank you, love source God. Thank you, thank you, thank you. That one. Questioning your beliefs. I immediately heard, do you believe that you can have a family and romance? Do you believe that? And then I also heard, don't you know that family comes out of romance? Wow. So romance and family actually really does go hand in hand. What is the tarot message that goes with this for us today, love source God? Thank you, thank you, thank you. I feel that somebody's uh, in a similar situation to mine and just having a hard time trying to figure out if they can um, even entertain romance. Because when I say similar situation to mine, I have a house full of children. So... For some of you, that's an issue, and you are looking at holding on to the things you value. You're like, there's no way I'm going to let go of the things that are important. My family is the most important thing. That's my foundational block. And so you you got some concerns going on. For some of you, it's translating into worry, and most of you, you're just trying to get yourself in line. And, and I feel like what you've gotten in line with is, hey, this is my family. They're going nowhere. This is what really matters. This is where I'm going to focus. And so in the past, I feel that you had to focus on some romantic offers, some frivolous fun. And now you're like, if it's not solid, secure, and stable, and uh, truly of a divine nature, then it's just not going to be for me. It's not going to work for me because I need something that's going to incorporate my family. Somebody who's interested in being the king in our life. Um... And you know what? I am ready for a new start. Um, I see a lot of blue in this picture, so there's some calm over this. I feel like there's some calm energy over your romantic situation. And I feel that if you're involved with a uh, water sign, Cancer, Scorpio, or Pisces, you're going to be looking at, um, and maybe even it was in the past that you were involved, maybe you're involved presently, but I feel like you're really going to be looking at some of your core beliefs and how they affect um, this new opportunity that you're moving into and the new relationship that you want to have. And you're really, I feel, getting great clarity today on how you want this new relationship to go in your behalf and how you want it to play out. And as you see little hands dancing across the screen there, you see exactly what I'm talking about and you understand what I'm talking about. But I'm here to tell you, children come out of romance. And honey, if it's the right romance, then your children are going to be okay. Huh, Quentin? They should not question their beliefs about it. They should just trust that their family is their first, especially when there's little ones. Maybe not so much if everybody is grown and grown and acting up, but once when they're little ones, you really can't say or do anything about how they do things. I mean, you can try pushing their hand away, say, hey, could you be quiet? I'm trying to record a video. But they kind of do whatever in the heck they want to do. And they keep going for whatever they want to go for. And so if you're bringing somebody in, I feel like those are things that you've taken in consideration because I am getting that somebody out there 
you are going to have a fresh start with a water sign that you may have dealt with before and I feel like this water sign has matured and grown since y'all dealt with each other before. So this is your daily romance tarot. Make sure you check your daily general tarot and your daily money tarot as those are available for you on this channel. I'm so excited that I was finally able, of all those hours I stayed up early in the wee hours yesterday, I got all your Chinese zodiac tarots recorded and uploaded for you yesterday. So, tarot readings by your Chinese zodiac sign. I didn't see anyone else doing that on YouTube, so I'm going to own it. I'm the first one to do that for you here on YouTube. I hope you enjoy it. I think it's awesome. Some, some of you are having some wonderful resonance with it already. And also, um, we can design a custom Words of Clarity deck for you personally. If you would like that, my website has the details on how to move forward. Each card is custom channeled message for you, intended for you alone, from Love Source God, to benefit you on your spiritual growth and your spiritual journey here during this life. And if I can do a personal reading for you, uh, my website also has the details on that work that I do by donation only. And so you can go to my website, which is www.lphtarot.com. That's lphtarot.com, as in love, peace, and happiness to you and yours, and of course, me and mine. Until next time.